to get him to reveal the amulet's hiding place. Precisely. With the amulet at his command, Manny Marco believes he can trap Molag Baal's essence and absorb his power. He seeks to become a god himself. I'd love to discuss this further, but this is hardly the place. Get me to a safe haven and I will tell you the rest. That was our agreement, was it not? Now, let's... Wait. Did you feel that? Now, now, Tharn. No telling my secrets. Go to your room, Abner. I will deal with you shortly. Ah, dear Lyris. Your old position at the Foundry is still available. We'll even give you your own set of unbreakable chain. And you. The thorn in my side. The pebble in my shoe. How strong. Shall we test you? This drains the energy from most victims, yet you keep fighting! more can you take, I wonder? Chancellor of the Elder Council. His power wanes, Vestige. Strike him down while his attentions are on me. How dare you betray me, Zahn? Suffering with it, legend. He will not remain discorporated for long. His consciousness will be adrift for a few moments, but that is all. Because Manimarco has delusions of godhood. He cares nothing for the Empire. He seeks only power. I've never done battle with him before. He's far more powerful than I imagined. Oh well, too late for regrets. In for a bean, in for a beanstalk. First things first, we need to get out of here alive.
We certainly can't go back the way you came in. I'd imagine they're swarming the grounds already. There's a refuse chute further down the path. It's a bit of a drop, but we'll probably survive. and repeated blows to the head haven't dulled your wit, Titanborn. Hello again! Need a way out? I'll have that open in just a moment. Okay, preservers, you're as battered and bruised as a peach in a sack of rocks. Bit of the old daring do, was it? No matter. You'll be needing an escape route, no doubt. Well, it's what I do, quite honestly. We should probably hurry it up. The entire castle is as bristly as a sack of sewing needles after all that noise. Come with you? You mean leave Cold Harbor? Well, I, I don't know. It's been a very long time since I've seen the world I left behind. Do, do, do you think it's wise? Well, that's, uh, that's settled then. And after all, you do need someone to lead you out of here. Onward! Into the shoot, come on! Quickly, I've opened another portal. Hurry! All in the name of preserving the Empire. I swear by all the gods, Menemarka will pay dearly for this. Of course. I am Abnathan. It will take more than a few brainless cultists to rattle these old bones. Now then, where were we? Ah, yes. <clears throat> Truth be told, I don't know the precise location, but I do know that he is Manimarko's prisoner, and that the King of Worms is trying to pry the location of the amulet from him. Now, now, before you lose your temper, let me clarify. I don't know precisely where he is, but I can find out. I'll just need a little time. You son of a bitch! Ah! Are you insane? Get away from me, you brutish she-troll! Lewis, stand down. He's done nothing but lie to us from the beginning. I don't care what he says. He'll always be Menemarko's toady. Please! Menemarko wants me dead. Did I pretend to capitulate to him? Yes, I did. Do you have any idea how many lives I saved by doing so? The only thing you saved was your holdings and your own hide, you pompous ass! Enough! Abner had no choice, Lewis. And we are guilty of our own deceit, are we not? The time has come for the Vestige to know the truth. What's this? The Vestige doesn't know? Oh, this is rich. 
Sire, don't. Vestridge, until now, you've only known me as the Prophet. But that is not my true name. I am Veron Aquilarius. Our fallen Emperor, in the tattered robes of a moth priest, blind as a newborn kitten. I am sorry I deceived you, Vestridge. You're angry. It is to be expected. 